How's it going, guys? It's me, Sanai. Uh, day 33, yes. And um, just a quick, uh, this is a quick uh, thing, you guys. If you're not paying attention to the news right now, uh, I was gonna talk about that that Marine throwing the, the dog, which is pretty pathetic. But I'm, I'm not even gonna talk about that. I'm gonna um, draw on something that appeals to me because that dog thing that's just some sick shit right there. Um, I was going to talk about right now uh, with something that's not really getting covered that much in the prime time news. If you watch the news, if you, you know, pay attention to stuff, keep up with events like I do, uh, I just want to talk about how um, right now uh, in, in the Gaza Strip, if, which is which is in Palestine, you know, in the Middle East, um, right now um, uh, Israel um, it's bombing. Um, the Gaza Strip is cutting off uh, access, you know, to to you know over like a hundred people, a hundred uh, women and children have died. Palestinian women and children have died, and um, I just want you know, I just want to let you guys know about that because I'm, you know, whenever I do see news talking about Israel and the Palestinians or anything, it's always like, oh, Israel had to go in and march in to defend himself from the Palestinians and, and stuff, right? I understand like the fact that uh, they're saying this is I'm getting this from the BBC because that's like a f one of the few um, news sources that I pay attention to. The BBC is saying that Hamas, which runs Gaza Strip, is uh, sending rockets into uh, the neighboring Israeli areas. But um, the fact of the matter is uh, Israel is, is the aggressor, and I, I understand that both sides are, can't have. Uh, only one side being right and one side being wrong because both sides are on the wrong of this. But at the same time, over a hundred women and children have died and I think it's uh, the international community should get involved. People outside of, you know, Palestine and stuff should get involved with this. You know, if you, I see people getting, you know, uh, Dar Darfur and, and, and uh, Uganda with the invisible children there and all that. I'm just saying, you know, people should pay attention to what's going on around the world and get involved and do something about it. Don't just sit back and complain about stuff. You know, if you want to better the world and better the society that you live in, you should go out and do something about it. So I have to say, peace, like the academy.